boxing. It was a warm summer day. And Peacock. <laughs> That's me. I had just got in from her morning run. Everyone thought Miss Scarlett did it. <laughs> so she was the one who found the body. <laughs> but I don't think so. <laughs> Mr. Green was too casual, even though that's why I thought he did it first. <laughs> and with the pistol, of course, him being the only black man. But then I started to think. Maybe it was Professor Plum. Mm -hmm. He's the only person who could have had the smarts to pull something off like this. But you know what? He that smoked weed earlier. That was too obvious. He smoked weed earlier. At the time of the murder, Professor Plum was with me. Alright, come on, Cody, let a guy So <laughs> Nancy Drew. Sherlock Holmes. He's Sherlock Holmes. Now, when I look at the person who came in the door that day, it's Mr. Green. Mr. Green. He looks kind of vexed to see who answered the door. It was Colonel Mustard. Colonel Mustard answered the door, and I was wondering why this person looked at him as if he knew him already. And then it came to me. It was one of Colonel Mustard's old cadets, or whatever they were. Privates. Hmm? Privates. Privates, yes. Yes. The Colonel, I... being a man of skill or whatever, I knew he wouldn't have done it with the weapon so lethal. Not anything is a knife. I mean, we could have clearly looked and seen the precision. I'm pretty sure he wouldn't have done it with a bat with all his honor. Over the rope, over the gun, he was going to take the less obvious approach and try to frame Miss Peacock. Her being all framed and old and whatnot. <laughs> this person was killed with poison. And the killer... It's kind of mustard. <laughs> In the theater? In the theater. Ah! Ah! I didn't do it. I didn't do it, Willis. I didn't do it. Ah! Da! 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 That's what I was going to go to. I was going to go tell for my damn self.